Hello all, welcome to eDraw Max. Let's begin with understanding of piping and instrumentation diagram. A piping and instrumentation diagram is a detailed diagram in the process industry, which shows the piping and process equipment together with the instrumentation and control devices. A set of standardized PID symbols is used by process engineers to draw such diagrams. PID symbols exist for all major components and lines, such as valves, vessels, instruments, pumps, compressors and towers. The ISA, S5.1, ISO 10628, and BS5070 cover the standardization of PID symbols and guide process engineers in their plant design activities. Let's see some PID symbols. This is the PT, this is control valve, and this is a heat exchanger PID symbol. We can identify symbols from legend given in any kind of PID diagram. In the legend, all symbols are given of related PID diagram. So we can easily identify PID symbols. Let's understand some commonly used symbols in the PID diagram. These are the piping symbols which is used to draw the piping line in PID diagram of any process plant. These are the pumps and compressor symbols, pump and compressor have many types of symbols, like centrifugal, reciprocating, screw, etc. These are designed to move any fluids or gases. These are different type of valve symbols, valve are used to control the flow of any fluids or gases. Valve are different types, for example, hand-operated valve, motorized valve, angle valve, back pressure operated valves. Vessels are used to store any fluid material, gases or we can also store solid products in the vessel. Solid products are powder, ash, etc. A heat exchanger is a system used to transfer heat between two or more fluids. Heat exchangers are used in both cooling and heating processes. From household fans to industrial compressors, centrifugal or reciprocating pumps, mixers, crushers etc. There are wide variety of motors used in a process plant. Here is a list of symbols of such motors. These are instrument signals. Instrument signals are very important sign in any kind of PID diagram. These are instrument symbols. We can easily identify instruments and its types by these symbols. You can also check out these symbols in the eDraw Max website. Article link is given in the video description below. Now understand identification of letter combination. In this symbol, first letter is a variable that being measured. In this case, this is F, means flow, second letter is denoted for what it does. In this case, this is I, means indicator. And the third letter is, what is the purpose of instrument, in this case, this is C, means it is a controller. And the 55 is the number to identification loop number. Direct line are denoted for instrument is located on the main control panel and available for the panel operator. Dashed line is denoted for the behind control panel remote location, and the no line means it is a field mounted instrument and accessible for the operator. We can find all kind of PID symbols in the eDraw Max Symbols Library. Please find the link in the description below to try eDraw Max online or download the software. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more videos.